All right, hello, welcome back, guys, to another episode of Hearts of Iron. I bet you guys are wondering, Alex, you're playing the USA. Why? Well, random viewer who's probably may or may not be asking that question. Um, I decided that the Spain it was fun, but it's just not for me, right? It it was okay, but it got really boring. I played a little bit. I have videos if you guys want me to upload those, I can. Um, but I just thought it was repetitive and there wasn't much done so i decided to do something that we talked about in this straw poll and that was playing as the u.s and we're gonna be playing as the the reincarnation of the confederates aka whatever they're called uh stuff people like that so you were moved i sorry about that that was brandon um I'm going to do the U.S. Civil War. Hopefully, maybe I can avoid it. I don't necessarily know how it works, so that's probably your indication that I'm not going to be able to avoid it. Um, let's do like cruisers. Okay, and that's all sorted out. We are the U.S. of A. Just in case the Civil War does happen, let's try to uh, industrialize the South. So we have Omar Bradley, one of the great warriors of World War II. Did a lot there. Election gridlock in France. Great Depression. So I can't do anything about my economy yet. So there isn't much to do there. So I can't do anything because obviously I'm in very negative political power. Nineteen thirty six Stanley Cup. Well, we're starting to develop some political power, it's not enough to, uh... We actually have enough here. Do 
Arab Congress. Still can't research anything. Let's not go more communist than we have to. Not do a location yet, just in case the civil war does happen. Jack Reed is now gaining power. Done a lot, little research into this. Um, I think I've read that book before for school. Threatened by the King of Canada. Do we got, oh, we got the bay. We still have the bay. Okay, so we're moving that there. Let's move these guys here. Let's see, where else can we move? Okay. Oh, our stability is going up. The election, I think, is next month, so that's pretty good. If we look at the uh, old uh, faction focus tree, not faction focus tree, but who's in what. No, we're not gonna. We're stuck in a kind of position here. These guys are getting a little powerful. Going totalist, that's very far. <clears throat> so our low stability should go to average soon. Let's add a few more units. How we decide the fate of the Civil War. I think President Long. Let's 
we do that, and then this guy is how to avoid the civil war. No. Let's do Huey Long. Too long will carry us to victory. Paternal autocrats. This former farmer relief bill that would help the farmers throughout the country. Sinclair thought kind of that was reformed didn't go far enough. What conservatives counter it goes too far, despite it seems rather popular throughout the country. Dangerous choice for the country. He encouraged Republicans, Democrats, to form an alliance, to keep law in check. Okay, well, how do we win then? If you're supposed to be kept in check, <clears throat> let's work on mechanical computing. God, the CSA is really screwing me over here. Okay, so now we're getting some tariffs. So this is a very conservative thing to do. And then, uh, building up a fleet here. need 15 divisions to send volunteers. America is not doing too well. Oh. Do some coast to coast reforms. Man, we are really getting screwed over by this political power. Major point of Long's forms is to bring industry and jobs to the East Coast. Long has been suspicious of the industrial barons in California. Uh, who saw us interested in making money uh, at the expense of the American people? Spring of 1937, the country is still in economic chaos. Long launched a series of reforms to bring the economy and industry under stricter political and corporate control. Depending on how aggressive the forms are, no, uh, um, moderate, yeah, let's do moderate reforms, blended control. Read and trade unions. Had for several months crippled the nation's industry in the north. Hoover was unable to break the unions. Long despised. New president would not tolerate the read. Yeah, let's send in the Minutemen. Making them illegal is probably just gonna piss them off. Um. It was one of the biggest, most profitable industries in the United States and was looking to some of this. 
fund economic tax is profitable would not be higher avoid tax yeah taxing people is not the uh, conservative agenda we're going for here let's finish this up and we'll end here it is there something gonna come up all right this is probably a good place to end uh, we'll tune in next episode to see what happens